Hello there, prequel memers, you guys know what to do. And welcome to recent pickups. It's been a few months since I've done the last one because I moved four times in three months, so I haven't had time to do this. I picked up a lot of stuff since then, so we're gonna get straight to the video. But first off, I wanna let you guys know that I have teamed up with this brand called Allo Yoga. I'm wearing their shirt right now, and I really like their stuff, so you're gonna hear me talk about it whenever we get to it. But first off, let's talk about all the little stuff I picked up. I picked up crew socks from Uniqlo. Different color crew socks, got navy, orange, a heather brown, cream color, and have olive as well that's in the laundry. I have also picked up some beanies. This one is the uh, same mustard yellow beanie I have from before, but this is more of a uh, fisherman, like legit fisherman beanie. The other one's more longer, so it doesn't really look too too good if you double roll it because it'll be too thick and it'll just look awkward so and i've also picked up a black one as well with these you kind of want to wear it a little bit tighter on your head when you first get them that way you can stretch out a little bit and then it'll come out to be a good shape and then next up with our current situation of 2020 i've picked up some face masks so i have the air and face masks they are a lot more breathable than the cotton ones definitely recommend those for you guys just for standard comfort but whenever it comes to the winter time i would stick to the cotton ones um, these ones right here are from Orbit Gear. So these ones actually have been tested to be 99.99% effective against the COVID-19 virus for 30 minutes. And they have a tactical look, which goes with my style. So if you guys are looking for a more tactical face mask, definitely roll with Orbit Gear. I have three colorways, one in the blue, one in the olive, and then the all black. And these ones are surprisingly just as breathable. Okay, so next up is everything from Allo Yoga, which they are sponsoring this video. So if you guys don't know Allo Yoga, obviously in their name, they focus on yoga, which you guys might be like, yoga? This is not, this is not, this is not a brand for me. Well, you guys work out, everybody works out, and I just consider their brand as an athleisure brand. And what I really like about their brand is they are 100% sweatshop free, and they also use the best low water dyes for beautiful colors like this. So let's get straight to the pieces. This is the Idol Performance Tee. I'm wearing the long sleeve version of this, but basically these tees are super, super comfortable and breathable. So that makes these tees perfect for lounging around or working out. And the fit of these tees are not super fitted, which is something I really like and prefer. Unlike these other brands, which their tees are just way too tight and way too fitted, and it could come off looking too much like a bro in my opinion, and that's just not my preference. So these are gonna be true to size, but I'm wearing a size large because I like them a little bit more loose. And I'm telling you guys, the quality is on point when it comes to the stitching, the fitment, even their logo is 3M reflective, so this is a perfect run tee if you guys are into running or even just casual lifting they have a split hem which the split does have a 3m reflective material and this one specifically is in their baltic colorway which is more of a like a teal color so this colorway is definitely going to allow you to step out of your comfort zone in terms of color but they also have your normal colors you know black gray and all that good stuff so if you guys are looking for a new top for working out so definitely pick up this one right here you can roll with this colorway if you want or you can roll with the neutrals totally up to you but let's move on to the next piece from aloe yoga and that is their base sweatpants so you guys saw my last video on how to style vans these really give off those fear of God seventh collection vibes if you guys have seen the lookbook it's super casual mixed with classic menswear and that's the reason why I picked this one up so this is a cream colorway and I rolled with cream because it gives it a more modern look versus a classic gray sweatpants which can come off a little too you know, cozy, lazy, and just for wearing at home. And you can dress this up and down. Like I said, this is a sweatpants, so you can wear it for the more cozy vibes, or you can dress it up a little bit, like the Fear of God 7th Collection. So you'll see me wearing these with leather jackets and a hoodie as well, just so it doesn't come off way too casual. This is definitely my favorite piece from Aloe Yoga. They got the thicker drawstrings. Has a really nice cuff as well, perfect for that tapered look. So if you guys are looking for sweatpants with a modern fit, definitely roll with the cream colorway, and definitely roll with this base sweatpants from Aloe Yoga. Yoga. And this is the last piece from Allo Yoga. This is the Triumph Track Pants. These really give off those Eddie Goro Tekken vibes, so I feel like doing Capoeira in these, man. But what I like about these is they have a more baggier fit with a cuff as well. So that's something that's kind of picking up some speed is that little cuff where they can adjust it. So it's super baggy and then it cuffs really tight at the bottom. This will give you that same exact look except for you'll get 3M reflective material, you'll get zipper pockets, and this is a woven nylon so it's very breathable. Not, not waterproof but that's totally cool. You know it has that classic nylon sound. This is a great pickup if you guys are looking for a new pants for working out that aren't super tight but you can also run in as well because of that 3M reflective material. This is definitely a great pants. I would try and pick up the black colorway if you'd like. 
Uh, the Baltic one's pretty dope as well, but it's a little bit too bold, which may not be your guys' preference. I will leave links in the description where you guys can pick these up. Those will be affiliate links just to be transparent with you guys. Athleisure is definitely the way for 2020 because we're staying home so much, but it can also be styled tastefully as well. So definitely check out Alo Yoga. This next pickup is something I got from Chicago on my road trip to New York City. This one I got from the Sears Tower gift shop. So you guys know I always recommend checking out gift shops and stuff and museums, coffee shops and all that. So this one is an anorak. Think of it like a windbreaker, but it's a quarter zip. It's the same exact thing with a hoodie. So this is waterproof and windproof. And this one's also printed on Champion. So you guys know that the quality is there. Now let's talk about a sneaker. So I'm sure you guys know about these already. This is the a Cold Wall collaboration with Converse. And these are just my favorite pickups of all time so far. When I first saw these, I knew I wanted them instantly. It was basically the same feeling I had when I came to the Nike Element 87s. I just knew I had to pick these up. And these are definitely worth it if you guys can pick some up. I did pay $30 over retail. So in the resale market before the price shot up. So I, I kind of lucked out. But these have a sneaker boot type look and it kind of goes with that military tech wear aesthetic. But they can also be rocked with just traditional streetwear outfits. These are waterproof, but just be aware that these are super heavy. If you guys have ever had Tim's, these feel pretty much the same exact weight. It's very heavy on your foot, so every time you pick it up, you're gonna feel it. But the design, the colorway is definitely something to be praised. They also have a all black one if you guys want something a little bit more neutral. And yeah, I would definitely recommend this if you guys pick it up. You guys have seen me wear this in a more tech wear outfits. And speaking of that specific outfits, let's talk about the next item. And that is this Orbit Gear Falcon Duke sling bag. So what I like about this is it has a tote bag type of vibe mixed with a tactical technical look. So. Got the handles like a tote bag. It's not as long like a tote bag, but still cool. This is the olive colorway. So all of Orbit Gear stuff is handmade in Indonesia and they definitely use great quality materials. They have a YKK zipper system. <laughs> it is weatherproof and they have plenty of zippers, clips, and a modular system so you can buy mods and attach it to here for extra storage and all that. This is definitely a backpack replacement with deep pockets. Could definitely hold a 17 inch laptop and it's just super deep. And it has a three axis sling for more security. So if you guys live in a big city, you don't have to worry about your stuff being stolen. So the next item up is from 511 Tactical. These are the Apex Cargos. These are the same exact ones as my black ones that you guys always ask me about. This is just in an olive colorway and I definitely recommend these as a budget tech wear piece because yes, this does have a DW are coating making it weatherproof has plenty of storage and functionality and it just looks really good as well they have zipper cargos and plenty of pockets I, I can't even count how many pockets they have on here they even have a hidden one right here so you can put a handcuff key if you ever find yourself in a bad situation and yeah there's your answer the 511 apex cargos definitely recommend this as a starter tech wear cargo so now we have uniqlo stuff this is the pocket long sleeve and i'm wearing a size medium by the way and it does fit a little bit more loose nothing too tight which is definitely a vibe right now and brown is just something I've been on as well. So I picked up their, you guys know I talk about the Arism boxy oversized tee and I picked it up in a light brown as well because I've just been on that brown wave. So if you guys are looking for more oversized tees, definitely check out Uniqlo. And I also have the same Arism boxy tee in their nude colorway. So it's more like a, yeah, nude's probably the best way to explain this color. Nude, blush-ish. This is my favorite shirt of all time. I have all the colors. And I definitely recommend you guys pick up the boxy tee from Uniqlo. It's only $14.90 or something like that. And it's a great start to getting you into more relaxed fitting stuff instead of the fitted, fitted clothes all the time. And now we have the worker shirt from Uniqlo as well. This is the same exact one as my tan ones. This is just an olive color. So with work shirts, definitely just treat them like a denim jacket. That's what a denim jacket is anyways, is a worker's jacket. And I like to wear this in two ways. I either like to button it up and leave the bottom two unbuttoned so you can see the, the colors or the layers, or you can just rock it normally. So the last item up is this corduroy button up from Uniqlo, and this has a mandarin collar. So it's not your traditional collar that has a little pointiness and all that where you can wear it with a tie. You definitely can't wear this with the tie, but mandarin collars is just something I've been appreciating a lot lately. It's very simplistic, nothing too crazy. Not many people wear it. And this too, I like to wear with all the buttons buttoned up except for the bottom buttons. That way you can show the layers. You'll see these items worn in a lot more smart tech wear settings. And these definitely give off the Vinaya collection vibes, which is why I picked it up. It's way more affordable. And corduroy is back. So it's a great mix up in terms of fabric. You know, having some more fabric separation, especially if you wear an all black outfit, this is something that you definitely need. Because if you wear the same fabric all the way top to bottom, you're just gonna look like a silhouette. And the corduroy is a nice way to break that up. So that is all my recent pickups. Hope you guys found this video helpful or informative. So go ahead and follow me on Instagram at Ty. Leave a comment down below if you're a prequel memer and subscribe.